trust, but verify. For sometimes the sweetest song hides the sharpest fangs, she learned a harsh yet valuable lesson. Kindness wasn't always what it seemed. Appearances could be deceiving, and blind trust was a dangerous path. The true treasures were the flawed, imperfect relationships she already had, waiting to be nurtured and cherished. As she sewed a replacement button eye for the talking cat, a silent understanding passed between them. The experience, etched in her memory, would forever be a reminder. Trust, but verify, for sometimes the sweetest song hides the sharpest fangs. Coraline, a wisp of a girl with hair like spun twilight, poked a finger through the peeling wallpaper in her new apartment. Rain lashed the windows, mirroring the melancholic mood that clung to her like a shroud. Her parents, perpetually hunched over their computers, barely registered her existence. Longing for connection, Coraline explored, finding a tiny button door hidden behind the peeling paper. With a thrill of adventurous curiosity, Coraline pushed a button eye and squeezed through. The world beyond shimmered, an echo of her own. Here, vibrant gardens bloomed, a talking cat with a mischievous glint roamed, and her other parents awaited. The other mother, all smiles and silken whispers, showered Coraline with affection, cooking delectable meals and listening with rapt attention. It was a dream come true, a world sculpted from Coraline's deepest desires. But the dream soon turned sour. Coraline noticed the unsettling gleam in the other mother's button eyes and the unsettling chill that followed her compliments. The talking mice warned of a sinister plot of stolen souls imprisoned behind the buttons sewn into the other mother's victim's eyes. The truth unraveled. This paradise was a cage, the kindness a facade to lure in the unwary. Coraline, no longer the naive explorer, steeled herself. She remembered her real parents, their imperfections a badge of genuine love. Armed with a cunning mind and the unwavering support of the ghost children, Coraline faced the other mother in a series of nightmarish games. She outsmarted her, using the very things the other mother offered. The playful buttons, the talking cat, the ghost children's unyielding loyalty. Finally, with a resolute snap of her button-eye key, Coraline slammed the door shut on the other world, severing its hold. Back in her own world, the rain had stopped. Sunlight streamed through the window, washing away the gloom. Her parents, alerted by Coraline's resourcefulness, finally looked up from their computers, their eyes filled with genuine concern. The world was no longer perfect, but it was real, filled with the messy beauty of human connection. Moral of the story. Not everyone that are kind to you have good intentions. Trust, but verify, for sometimes, the sweetest song hides the sharpest fangs. Remember this. Also teach this lesson to those who are too innocent and can't understand this harsh reality because it seems everyone angel to them. But the truth is, innocence will kill you if you couldn't recognize the real anacondas in your life. Be aware.